of trading fireworks for power tools, sandals for working shoes, and a day at the beach for a day of service. That's pretty much God's plan was just to bring us down to Wilmington, North Carolina. Not your typical way to spend the 4th of July. Taking a break from rebuilding a deck for a local veteran, these teenagers from across the country say it's a labor of love. It is hot, but we're also doing it for a greater good. We're doing it um, to show God's love again. The heat, the um, rain sometimes, and uh, labor um, won't make us change our relationship with God. When he calls us to serve, we come into action. You know, it's a bunch of hot and sweaty people doing God's handiwork. Every nail, and every saw. It's a thank you, a favor, and a way to give back. He's been a very huge influence in my life, and it's just made my life better. You know, it's made me better as a person. To the homeowners, it makes all the difference. For Paul Parton, this is a lot more than a new deck. I am super truthfully excited about what they've already done and the way they're getting it shaped up. This is stuff that uh, they want to do for a good while, but we've had a lot of sickness. They're superheroes for a fact in my book. Parton even stepped aside from our interview to tell the volunteers thank you. I won't forget you. I really won't. My wife won't either. Uh, that's the truth. That's from the heart. It really can impact you, and you won't know that until you try it. And most of them plan to do it all again, this time next year.